The reason, therefore, that um, Israel is the biggest recipient of uh, American uh, aid and military support is because this hand called the House of Rothschild takes the money from the United States and hands it to this hand uh, called Israel of the House of Rothschild and says thank you very much. The reason that uh, there's no questioning of uh, um, Israeli uh, nuclear capability that they get away literally with mass murder time and time again is because the House of Rothschild also controls the countries of the European Union and controls the European Union. I mean, Tony Blair is a yes sir, no sir, three bags full sir, how high would you like me to jump sir, front man for the House of Rothschild. So who do they put in after he left the uh, British government as negotiator of, of, of peace in, in, in Israel? Tony Bloody Blair. What shall I say, Mr. Rothschild? Thank you very much. Thank you. That's, that's, thank you. Thank you. And that's it. So wh when you've got the same force controlling all these different agencies, then, of course, they're going to be coordinated. That's why Israel gets away with what it gets away with. And if people think that's anti-Semitic, well, actually, anti-Semitic means anti-Arab, by the way, um, then they'll have to take it and shove it somewhere where the sun don't shine. Because I ain't shutting up about this because it's fundamental uh, to understanding the world and to understanding um, the European Union and, 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 and world events. The Jewish people in general have been mercilessly used by the House of Rothschild and their front secret society, sat satanic secret society called uh, Zionism, as a front which they can hide behind. So it is House of Rothschild organizations like B'nai B'rith, Sons of the Covenant, who created uh, an organization uh, called the Anti-Defamation League, um, which goes around defaming everyone, uh, uh, ironically, um, who have not just campaigned for hate laws that stop you um, exposing these people, they've actually written the bloody legislation in America, in North America, in Canada. And so these hate laws, which say you can't say this, you can't say that because that's prejudice and all that, they're not there to protect uh, gay people. Uh, everyone to their own, I say, I can care less. Um, uh, they're not there to protect Jewish people or, or, or minorities. They're there simply to stop legitimate investigation of the Rothschilds and its network. That's what they're there for. And um, they are in so many ways the Rothschilds. At operational level, the center of the spider's web. And they need to be exposed because if they get exposed and they go, when I say go, they are uh, removed from their positions of power. Because, uh, to be honest, if they went to, to jail for what they have been responsible for, the House of Rothschild, they would have to reincarnate hundreds of times to complete the sentence. And um, we, we've ignored them, or we've not ignored them, people have ignored their power for long enough because they've brilliantly hidden it. Needs, it needs the, the light shone on it because when they come down, in so many ways, the house of cards comes down. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.